cannot keep shit to myself. So imagine how much it pains me not to be able to tell you beautiful people that for over 30 years, I've been in a very strange food-related 12-step program called Overeaters Anonymous. What? A white woman was bulimic? How did it? <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I lost interest in my own narrative. <laughs> I've been in a money-related 12-step program for about 25 years because I wasn't sure, still not completely clear, on how to have and keep a job. <laughs> Uh, even today, I had to double check with the producer. So it's right at that moment. Okay, you guys need me. And so then when I get there, then I got to stay. <laughs> what if Mama feels done? <laughs> I've arrived late and left early for my own television performances. <laughs> Uh, I was also briefly in Sex and Love Addicts Anonymous because I had a lot of compulsive one-night stands in the late 90s. Freeway entrance ramp motels, red roof in, the door doesn't lock everybody in. <laughs> so gross. You know, these groups have been so helpful to me. I mean, yeah, they're crappy, amateur, not great, uh, but they helped, uh, free. <laughs> groups, I'd love to tell you which groups I attend, but, you know, secret, is, secret society, I cannot, I cannot. <laughs>